Miss Bennett. Mr. Darcy. I am come to inquire after my sister. On foot. As you see. Would you be so kind as to take me to her? must allow her to be an excellent walker, I suppose. But her appearance this morning, she really looked almost wild. Hardly keep my countenance. What does she mean by scampering about the country because her sister has a cold? <laughs> her hair, Louisa. Well, her petticoat. I hope you saw her petticoat, brother. Six inches deep in mud, I'm absolutely certain. I must confess it quite escaped my notice. I thought she looked remarkably well. You observed it, I'm sure, Mr. Darcy. I did. I'm inclined to think you wouldn't wish your sister to make such an exhibition. Certainly not. It seems to me to show an abominable sort of conceited independence. Hmm? It shows an affection for her sister that is very pleasing. I'm afraid, Mr. Darcy, that this escapade may have affected your admiration for her fine eyes. Not at all. They were brightened by the exercise. But Jane Bennett is a sweet girl. It's very sad she should have such an unfortunate family, such low connections. Their uncle, she told us, is in trade and lives in Cheapside. Well, perhaps we should call when we are next in town. <laughs> They would be just as agreeable to me had they uncles enough to fill all cheap sides. With such connections, they can have very little chance of marrying well, Bingley. That is the material point. Miss Barrett, how does your sister do? Is she any better? I'm afraid that she's quite unwell, Mr. Bingley. Let me send for Mr. Jones, and you must stay until your sister is recovered. Oh, I would not wish to inconvenience you. I wouldn't hear of anything else. I'll send to Longbourn for your clothes directly. You're very kind, sir. Had a very sport today, or not? I disgrace you, do you think? You look very pretty, Lizzie, as you are well aware. Oh, Jane, I'd much rather stay here with you. The superior sisters wish me miles away. Only your Mr. Bingley is civil and attentive. He is not my Mr. Bingley, Lizzie. Oh, I think he is. Or oh, he very soon will be. <laughs> 